Warm welcome students of this academy's chapter active and passive voice. So what is a active voice and what is a passive voice? You already know that in the previous classes active voice means like simple sentences that means positive sentences like the hunter killed the deer and the deer was killed by the hunter this is a passive voice sentence okay so what is the difference between these two sentences in sentence one the subject hunter is the door of the action in the other word this the subject of the verb x or is active so the verb killed is therefore said to be in the active voice got it completely why is it second sentence is in passive voice sentence because of there is a object it will become in the first one like in the second to the subject dear is a receiver of the action and in the other word the subject of the verb does not perform the action or is not active or is passive so here the subject of the verb is acted upon and the verb was skilled is therefore said to be in the passive voice so we see that the active voice uh, the active voice denotes that the subject of a verb of the verb is the door of the action or is active so the passive voice denotes that the subject of the verb is the receiver of the action or is passive so active like subject okay and passive so this one is skilled so object was killed by so look at these some examples so we see then that when a sentence in change from the active from active form to the passive the object of the active verb becomes the subject of the passive verb so present tense means like active i see a golden duck passive a golden duck is seen okay in the third form okay i see a golden this is a present tense um, uh, simple present tense right but in the passive voice we have to use it is am are according to the noun okay got it completely according to the subject so a golden duck is seen a mule kills a snake so a snake is killed by a mule cats catch rats so rats are caught by cats okay rats are caught by cats let's see present continuous tense active is a mother is feeding a baby so passive voice a baby is being fed by a mother what is the difference of this one both because in the first one we have to use is am are and verb third form but in the present continuous tense we have to use it is being am being according to the subject okay and then verb third form next one children are working hard these days so hard work is being done by the children let's see the present perfect tense so the cats have caught all the rats so all the rats have been caught by the cats so in the present perfect tense we have to just put it been and also same things verb third form okay like sanjana has completed the work in time so the work has been completed by sanjana in time so what is the past tense simple past tense he sold his bike so we are, where we have to use it we have to use it here his bike was sold by him like in the present tense we have to use is am are and a uh, verb third form but in the past tense simple past tense we have to use it was were according to the subject and also verb third form okay so he sold his bike so his bike was sold by him father scolded the son so the son was scolded by the father a mad dog bit my friend so my friend was bitten by a mad dog let's see the next one past continuous tense so in the present continuous is being am being are being right but in the past continuous tense was being and verb third form were being 
and verb third form. Okay, let's see. Lalita was singing a song. So as well as you can see here, a song was being sung by Lalita. So they were throwing stones at the dogs. So stones were being thrown by them at the dogs because stones are plural words. So that's why we have to use your word. Okay, let's see the past perfect tense. So, in the present perfect tense, we have to use it only. See, uh, sorry, um, that means been only. Okay, only been we have to use it. So, here also we have to use it been. So, someone had stolen my mobile. So, my mobile had been stolen. Got it completely? As far as I told you in future tense in the previous class also simple future tense so the teacher will punish you for coming late so here but we have to change it you have to just put it will be and also verb third form be only we have to put it okay the teacher will punish you for coming late so you will be punished by the teacher for coming late she will never help you in your work so you will never be helped by her in your work I shall give her this pen. She will be given this pen by me. Everyone will laugh at you. You shall be laughed at by. Okay. So, in the passive verb, the passive of a verb is made by adding a suitable form of, of the verb to the past participle. Verbs which take two objects after them in the active voice can be changed to the passive in the following ways. Okay, and remember this thing, future continuous, no passive voice there. Okay, so she gave me a card, I was given a card by her. They gave me a card, a card was given to me by them. Okay, granny told me a story, I was told a story by granny. She teaches us English, so here we are taught English by her. The teacher gave him a prize. So, he was given a prize by the teacher. Let's see, interrogative sentences. Active voice, who broke this flower was? So, by whom? We have to use by. By whom was this flower was broken? Why did she scold us? Why were we scolded by her? How did he pass the exam? How was the exam passed by him? Who teaches you English? So, by whom are you taught English? Which doctor will treat you? By which doctor will you be treated? Who will help her? By whom will she be helped? So look at that this study table. Simple present where we have to use what we have to use. Okay, however we have to use it. Present continuous, present perfect and simple past. So you have to note down this table. You have to draw this table in your notebook. Got it everyone? Next year also and this one is your skill test. You have to do this work in your notebook also. Okay. This one also is skill test and also B, C. Okay. So this is your today assignment. Got it completely and also repetition this chapter again. Okay. Thank you.